Hello friends, I am Ashudev and today we have a new topic that is monsoon in India. Basically in India there are three main types of monsoon that is southwest monsoon, northeast monsoon and western disturbance. So my friends, southwest monsoon coming from Australia like southeast direction and when it comes into after equator it goes like southwest direction. So southwest monsoon has a two band. First we have a Arabian Sea Bank and second we have a Bay of Bengal Bank. So uh, this southwest monsoon gives 60% rain to in India and uh, this southwest monsoon like throughout the India there is a hot and humid climate in the month of June until August because sun, uh, sun is in Tropic of Cancer so that's why there is a hot weather climate so that's why there is a low pressure out there and here we have a moisture because there is a radiant sea. Because of moisture there is a high pressure. And so you know there is the wind flow from high pressure to low pressure. So there is a high pressure and there is a low pressure. So wind flow like high pressure to low pressure. So that's why it gives rain to India. Like from Bay of Bengal as well. So this uh, southwest monsoon is gives 60% rain into India. And here we have a western ghat and eastern ghat. So you see here the maximum uh, uh, rainfall area, like it's, uh, it gives a maximum rainfall region to this western ghat. And this western ghat gets many rivers, like uh, main rivers, you can say, if you talk about main river, there is a Godavari, and there is a Krishna, and there is a Kaveri. And these rivers have many tributaries which are falling from this western ghat. Because there is a uh, heavy rain, you can say, in the month of June and uh, July and August. So that's why it gives uh, main rain to India and many rivers to India. And here we have a uh, like northeast monsoon. So this northeast monsoon coming from the high of Siberia. So why high of Siberia? Because high because of low temperature out there, very low temperature. You can say in minus degree temperature out there in Siberia, in Russia. Siberia is in Russia and uh, there is a, a, a cold weather. So because of cold weather and low temperature, there is a high pressure out there. And in Bay of Bengal, there is a hot and humid climate on that time in the month of October to in, uh, December. So there is a high pressure and in the Bay of Bengal, there is a low pressure. So wind blows like northeast, blows like and it's great, mainly gives its rain to coastal region of Bay of Bengal that is Tamil Nadu, Andhra and some parts of Odisha and you, you can see here in the part of North Eastern region it gives mainly in these regions uh, rain so this is the northeast um, monsoon and in these days you uh, you can see uh, in the news that is a heavy rain less out in Chennai because of this northeastern monsoon and if you talk about this western disturbance so western disturbance coming from Mediterranean Sea that actually if you can say Ukraine in Mediterranean Sea uh, in the month of uh, December, January and February in the winter season in India so it gives rain to Indo-Gangetic Plain because in the Indo-Gangetic Plain because of plain region of India uh, like vast region, vast plain region of India that is the indo gangetic plain so in Mediterranean Sea there is a high pressure out there and in the indo gangetic plain there is a low pressure out there so because of wind blows like high pressure to low pressure as I told you earlier so so it gives uh, rain into uh, in the, uh, these regions in the, in, the, uh, in the winter season like in the winter season this western disturbance is very useful for the rabi crops so rabi crops like uh, you can cultivate uh, wheat, barley and maize. So in the uh, farmers uh, like uh, this western disturbance is a very useful for rabi crops, farmers and for agriculture in the month of uh, January, February or you can say winter season. So this is the western disturbance as I told you southwest monsoon, northeast monsoon and western disturbance. And this uh, Himalaya depicts, uh, you can say, play a major role in the northeast monsoon. 
in the in winter season it gives a uh, rain into india because there is a highland of india there is a, a first highland of india that is a uh, himalaya so this is also useful for the rain uh, in, in india and you can say tibetan plateau there is a tibetan plateau is, this one is also useful for the rain out uh, rain out in uh, throughout the in india uh, maybe in the north uh, northeastern uh, monsoon so friends uh, uh, in this entire session i covered the southwest monsoon northeast monsoon and western disturbance so my motto is to know what are the monsoon in india so basically there are three main monsoon in india that is the southwest northeast and western disturbance so <coughs> this is the entire session of monsoon in india and thank you my friends keep watching and keep updated uh, thank you my friends